I am in a motherfucking rush because I have about 12, 13, 14 machines I need to set up like ASAP because I do not have space for them in my house or in my room, nor do they make me any money. And I am very pleasantly uh, pleased to announce a home for one of my new sticker machines. Let's take a look. Hello, everyone. Hi, Dee Dee. <laughs> hey, Dee Dee, how are you? Glad you could join us. Let's take a look. Down the financial freedom halls. Went ahead and kind of made this its own little nook of candy goodness. I mean, look how good those peanut M&M's, M&M's, and peanut M&M's, peanut butter M&M's look. They look fresh. The machine pops off with the chrome. Over here we do have the Glow Pop Specialty Gumballs. Uh, we do have Pucker no, Up Tart Candy. Oh, th yeah, triple M&M oh, candy right, machine right that there. Oh, That's a uh, peanut butter M&M. Yeah. Wow, well, wow. Well. <laughs> I don't like chocolate. Uh, definitely need to you get the like label chocolate. for the Pucker Ups. Outside of that, we do have the Starburst Skittles. Everything looking fresh. The orange, or the yellow actually on the chrome. Like Looks pretty nice. Starburst. And then real quick, oh, back here, this is the proactively, uh, you know, looking for opportunity, right? Because I saw the sign where the guy was like, they're telling him not to stock up the machines either because they're not working or he's not doing the maintenance, but it's probably why none of this stuff is working. And that's when I saw an opportunity because I was like, dude, this guy, I mean, obviously you're not going to put money in right here, the mystery slots. You don't even know if anything is going to come out. And here, if you're lucky, maybe you get a Pokemon card, which is cool if it works. But overall, I mean, the sticker, ma the sticker machine is kind of obsolete. I mean, I don't know if the rest of this stuff is working. Uh, toy mix... Bouncy putties, I mean, that looks cool, but an empty sticker machine, so I just thought there's some runts, candy, pokeballs, Jolly Ranchers, nothing too exciting. Hey, how's it going? And then uh, I did bring in a sticker machine right here. Right now we do have some video game stickers with uh, Super Mario Brothers, Zelda, some Pokemon, and then some superhero. Uh, superhero marvel stickers and then you know every couple months or so i like to i have so many great stickers i was thinking about maybe bringing in some disney some lord of the rings star wars you know i got so many great stickers so we'll just see what's popular what's not and then switch them out accordingly from there uh that's pretty much it so just a new setup right there which is pretty cool and then uh you know gotta make the most out of the day so i got a lot more to do Peace. <laughs> Some serious neglection at this location. Come on, Corey. Honestly, it's not even that far from my house and it's like right off the freeway. I should be on it, yo. Let's take a look and see what the old is out. In with the new. Uh, the nice thing is this, uh, the temperature in here is super cool. Uh, the air conditioning is definitely on. There was a triple M&M, which look unfortunately like they're cracking and stuff. Uh, the birthday gumballs look a little choppy. And then the Skittles look relatively decent, but still not so good. Uh, so I just went ahead through in a four chamber. We're gonna try it out properly. I probably put too much candy in here. Uh, a little overflow on the Skittles. I try to keep it low on the uh, peanut M&Ms. You know, half a bucket on the um, specialty gumballs. And I know how popular the Starbursts are. And the nice thing is those don't really like expire. They retain their freshness pretty well. 
Um, overall, I think the levels look okay. But yeah, I mean, look at the difference in the machines, right? So hopefully them just seeing this and then seeing the freshness of the candy um, will get more action overall. I'm gonna pull this puppy out, see if it made any money. And um, this one's getting sold. Say goodbye to this machine. All right, so I did find the key to the kingdom of this candy machine. Uh, it is sunny, it is hot AF. Uh, might be hard to see, we're gonna do a count on it anyways. These numbers are drastically low, but remember, I mean, the candy looks like shit. Um, you know, it's tough, man. It is tough. I want, I want this location to succeed. I'm going to give it a chance with the best of the best, right? I'm putting in my best candy with my best candy machine. Uh, as far as how much money this made... Uh, we're looking at about a 1975 count. Um, seems to be all quarters, but remember, 1975 is not very good when, um, well, I'm going to have to throw away those M&Ms. That's going to take out of the profit. Those birthday cake gumballs are duns dunskies. And the Skittles, I might be able to salvage. So we're definitely losing a few bucks on candy.